Good morning to my middle schoolers. It is Thursday, November 12th. Here are the different things you will be doing for today on N2Y. Please do not forget that you also have your regular classes to be attending and checking on Google Classroom. So you will do your word study, your vocabulary words, and this is the activity board that we did yesterday in Google Hangout. If you choose to play that little board game for the vocabulary words, you'll have the story to read, comprehension questions, um, and then standards connections. This shows what happened first, next, and last in the story. You will have um, writing. And I will complete this with you. It shows a capital letter needs to begin with each sentence. People's names have capital letters. Names and places have capital letters. A period goes at the end of each sentence. And we need to find five words that need a capital letter and four places where we need a period. And then we'll have to number these in order of um, the events that would happen in that order. So I'm going to get my red marker out. Athena, that is someone's name, so we are going to need a capital A here. Athena is having a Thanksgiving, is having Thanksgiving in New York City. Okay, this N is lowercase. New York is a place, so it's a proper noun. It needs to be capitalized, and we need a period. Next, Athena sets the table, period. First, okay, here's the beginning of a sentence, so we need a capital F. First, Athena, we also need a capital A for Athena's name, helps her grandmother make the food. Need a period here. Last, we need a capital L to start our sentence. Last, everyone eats Thanksgiving dinner. Before eating, everyone says that they are what they are thankful for, period. Okay, five words that need a capital letter. One, two, three, four, five, and then four places we need a period. One, two, three, four. Okay, so we have five words with the capital and four places where we put a period. Next, we'll put these in order. So first, Athena is having a Thanksgiving in New York City. All right, so first, this would be number two. And then next would be number three, Athena sets the table. And then before eating would be number four. And then five, last, everyone eats the Thanksgiving dinner. You will have different geometry to work through. And your life skills application is um, the do's and don'ts of microwaving and the next slide goes through each step. So if you would like to do this at home, you can go ahead and do that and make yourself some popcorn and follow these directions. Also for science, this is not something you have to do, but you can do it. It is doing an experiment with water and lemon juice and seeing how things dissolve at um, either whether they're cold room temperature or hot water. So you would label these cups. So make sure if you would like to do this, make sure to ask mom or dad or grandma and grandpa to help you with this. That would be it for today. And I will see you tomorrow at our Google Hangout at nine o'clock for our news and hangout. Have a great day.